Yes, I'ma talk to him again. I'ma talk to him. I just like the sound. Yo, what's up, guys? I'm on my way to work. Happy Memorial Day, guys. Um, heading to work. The legs about to rain. Um, so everything is Gucci. Um, I received an email from my job yesterday about working on October 19th for the next practice in the park. So I submit my names here if I get chosen or not. So let's see what happens next month. So I think next month I'm gonna get money, money. Cause I booked myself for so many events and see what's gonna happen. So let's see what happens. But before I continue on, What's up, y'all? It is your boy, Coach Big Jaguars, or Coach Big Man. Welcome back to my channel. And today is work vlog day. Summer is almost ending. And let's see how this shit goes. But like I said, guys, I'll tell you guys later. I'm on my way to work. I'm going to show you how me getting on the ferry and everything else. was awesome. Can't really pronounce his name, but I took a video. Um, 
music with fire, so can't really say anything. Um, back over here again. I think it's Sunday, Sunday and Monday. So let's see how those days go. Oh, I just gotta check my calendar. Wait to see when I work. So yeah, so I'm gonna get in the train. I gotta take that. Hey, the archway. Look at my black ass. Oh. I enjoyed it. It's awesome. And I'll tell you later, guys. So, what's up, guys? I'm on my way home. I'm in an empty train. And I didn't have to pay for anything because the guy opened the door and I got in there. So I didn't really have to go see ride for a metric car. Um, I went the first car because there was like a homeless guy there talking to himself. So for me, I just tried to be safe and like dis dis distinct myself for from that. Um, pretty uh, announcement. So everybody knows that my Herbal Life coach and I'm trying to get clients for the upcoming challenge, for the September challenge. Um, December, the challenge starts on 12th and ends on, I think in October. Um, and I played that stupid anonymous game and stuff like that. So somebody sent an anonymous message saying, oh, um, Herbalife is the, Herbalife is the very risky, um, and stuff like that and I should get myself a personal trainer to help me reach my goals. Okay, so why do I have to say about that? I feel like people trying to discourage the brand, Herbal Life, and everything else like that. As for as myself, as a coach, I feel it really disbelievable because people don't really give, the, give that brand, give the products a chance because there's a lot of people out here that use Herbal Life. Even basketball players and soccer players put music. So, for people to say it's a pyramid scheme, I don't know why they say that. Because by the end of the day, it helps a lot of people with their weight and what they want to do for the goals and everything else. So, in my, in, and for me personally, if you don't like Herbal Life, just don't talk about it. Don't like have the name, don't try to tell people about it, about how bad is it, it's a pyramid scheme, and just try to get, to buy, get people to buy the product and stuff like that. Like I said, people do not give the brand a chance and so that's all I had to say but today like yesterday work was decent um the type of music that was playing in the concert that I, ne I never heard before um it's pretty amazing and in the locker room everybody was talking about it yo you be seeing it, old people young people even young kids into this type of music and stuff like that and I agree with that because when I was growing up, I like I was into the the old time music. So for me, it, it's pretty amazing seeing stuff like that, having young young kids into the music like that, and it's pretty awesome. So for me, it, it's pretty amazing. Like see like. Getting to discover other music besides hip hop, rap, R and B, Spanish, and everything else. This is for me. This is a, a type of music that I discover now. Like I heard it before, but hearing it in person, uh, artists, a musical artist, and everything else, and hearing the accent and the language is pretty awesome. Like I like I always like I said in my last video about the the Kendrick Lamar concert. I really, I really appreciate that Barclays Center really hired me as a ticket usher and getting to discover music and discovering new things about the world. So that's all I have to say, guys. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe, and comment down below what y'all think about the video. Um, right now. Almost at the 700 subscribers. Help me reach that 700. That we need 300 more to get a thousand. So, peace out and been.
great to talk to you again, and I will see you later. Okay, you can bet it. All this money in the air. Take-